Like and subscribe right now or this spider will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. If you are one of those people who like to drive 250 miles just to go to the nearest water slide like people in West Virginia do, then this video isn't for you. But if you are not one of those people, you have to think of some other creative ways of having some water slide based fun. People have made some of the most creative and amazing water slides in their backyards. Let's look at 10 of the craziest backyard water slides in the world. Number 10. Hillside Water Slide Most people who have hills near their homes don't turn them into water slides, but not these guys. The slide starts near the roof of their house with what looks like a custom-made building to get up to the hill and then take the water slide. The slide isn't bad either. It starts off from a very decent height, then there is a loop, and then the slide launches the person straight into a big pool of water. This type of slide is very rare because the risk of the loop breaking and falling is high. If you have a guest and you guys are looking for fun ways to hurt yourself, this isn't definitely the way to go. But we doubt that just two people would be able to make an amazing water slide like this. But the slide seems to work pretty well. It even has a safety bed on the loop, so the person on the slide doesn't hurt themselves. But seriously, don't try this at home if you do not have any experience in custom-built water slides. Number 9. Redneck Oasis just outside of Logan, Utah, there is a secret place that is said to be a redneck oasis. This place is basically known as the Grandpa's Hideaway, even though it is not really a hideaway anymore. This place used to be very low-key, but just like everything else, people ruined it too. Grandpa's Hideaway is filled with fun activities like high dives, zip lines, trampolines, and obviously this monstrous custom-made slide that takes the person straight to hell. The slide is really long as it starts from the top of the hill, where the riders get a pad so they don't burn themselves by the friction of the ride. If you don't use the pad, expect some skin to be torn off from your body because this slide isn't that smooth. The rider goes hurtling down the slide, and because it's too long and slippery, they gain some considerable speed, even though the slide is a bit bumpy. This redneck water slide isn't really that safe, as you can easily topple off either side or overshoot and end up hurting yourself. This is not a DIY, so don't try this at home. Number 8. Funk Bros Summer Slide When talking about giant slipping slides, it is impossible not to mention the 150 feet long slide that Funk Bros made for their YouTube channel. This slide is just a complete masterpiece. The slide cost them a sum of $25,000, which is a lot for a backyard slide, but when you see the slide, you will know why it costs so much. Every part of the water slide was custom made by the Funk Bros and some other friends, who also helped with the investment. The dug up giant pool took them three months. You heard that right, it basically took them a whole summer to build a mega backyard slide, and in the end, it was well worth it. They filled the pool with 185,000 gallons of water. The slide starts off from a hill and then throws the rider in the giant pool. The first person who used the slide almost got hurt by barely missing the sand dune due to less soap on the slide. Gotta have a lot of soap on the slides if you want to make it to the other end. Number 7. Wooden Slide most water slides are made from plastic or material that looks like plastic because it gets slippery easily and doesn't hurt people while they are riding on it. There is a very small chance that you would be walking away with some type of injury. Wood, on the other hand, is definitely more dangerous than plastic. While it can get slippery, it isn't exactly safe. Wood is hard, and if you get on a slide made from wood, there is a big chance that you would end up with some back pain at the very least. But that did not stop Michael Phillips from giving it a try. He and some friends went to a lake right by some houses and made a giant slippery slide, which is made from wood. The guys weren't stupid, so they used a plastic sheet to cover the wood so the rider doesn't have to slide on plain wood, which could be dangerous. Nevertheless, they knew how crazy this was, so they ended up calling the slide Slip and Bleed. Number 6. Longest Slide in the World you might think that some water park would have the longest slide in the world, but we are here to tell you that isn't the case. The longest water slide was made by a charity in New Zealand, and it really is the longest ever. The slide itself was 600 meters long with a 110 meter drop. Can you guess how long it would take for them to reach the end of the slide even at full speed? 90 seconds. The ride took the riders through the grassy hills of New Zealand's countryside, which is actually a beautiful scene and is definitely better than overpopulated amusement parks. Number 5. Halfpipe Slide 
When someone thinks of a halfpipe, most people would think of some edgy teenager doing tricks on his skateboard or Tony Hawk doing some crazy skateboarding. But have you ever heard of a slide made out of a halfpipe? This slide is built by an engineer, and the whole slide is made up of a halfpipe. The person managed to get 80 inches of PVC pipe, which he then cut open and laid out down a hill and out into a nearby lake. It may sound like an insane idea, but it is actually very smart. PVC piping is really strong, and it is one of the most widely used piping used in the world, and is perfect for a slide. The slide is a perfect fit for the rider. It takes them down at an incredibly fast speed and splashes them into the lake. Would you get on a slide made of PVC pipe? Number 4. Slide in Maui If you have been to Hawaii, you would know that Maui is its second biggest and most beautiful island. It has beautiful weather and some of the most gorgeous natural beauty you would ever see. If you find yourself chilling in a pond next to a hill, you might get the idea of building a water slide. That is exactly what this guy, Adrian, did. He dug up a slideway to the hill following a little curve that takes the rider to the bottom so they could reach its destination. The slide itself isn't that long or fun, but it shows you some of the most beautiful sights on Maui. That is some project for a single guy. The slope gets really steep at the end of the ride, crashing the rider into the pool at a fairly high speed. Number 3. Corn Maze Farm Slide The Little Bear Bottoms Corn Maze is a family farm that has been growing corn for centuries and allows people to explore the corn maze. But in summer, exploring corn mazes isn't really popular. So what did the owner do to gain popularity? A giant corn maze homemade slide. The slide itself is really long and steep. The owners of Little Bear Bottoms found the steepest hill, and they built this massive slide into it. This slide is very different because it doesn't have a pool at the end, and the slide is long enough that the rider automatically slows down at the end of it. As mentioned already, the slide is really steep, and some people have estimated that the rider gets a speed of more than 30 miles per hour normally. The slide is also dangerous because it doesn't have any corners to stop the rider from tripping to the side and hurting himself. And because of no pool at the end, if you are too fast, you might end up falling in the mud. Would you ride down this long slide? And with that, it's now time for today's subscriber pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber. If you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might even feature it on a future video. Number 2. This seems like a photoshopped picture, as we could not find anything related to it on the internet. The idea behind this picture is a backyard water slide, but this slide is too steep with a huge jump in the end. We doubt that the rider would be able to make it to the pool. The same thing happened to a French kid who built a massive slide in his backyard, but the slide was a little too perfect. When he rode down it, he didn't calculate the jump and ended up missing the pool completely, falling in the mud. Poor kid. Number 1. Surfing Slide Roman Atwood is known for his crazy vlogs and projects. When he commits to something, he goes pretty hard on it. And the same thing happened with this huge water slide he built in his backyard. The whole slide was made from wood. And because it would be crazy to slide down on wood, he laid down layers of plastic sheets. The slide also had a pipe under it and a generator pump that would take the water up the stairs and then back down the slide itself to make it more slippery. But the slide wasn't made properly because the riders weren't able to reach the pond, which is the whole point of the water slide. So Roman brought out the big guns, floaters. These things help the riders make their way to the pond and complete the perfect ride. The best thing about the slide? You can even surf on it. That is our list of top 10 craziest backyard water slides in the world. Which one is your favorite that you'd like to slide down? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.